So I'm doing an ambassadorship for the next year with Symmetry Trailers and I will be posting on my Instagram at so.in.tents, so intense. And I'm just gonna give you guys a little bit of a demonstration of this custom trailer that I had them make for me. First the battery, which you switch on down here. And then there's this little control panel right here that's pretty cool. It powers a couple um, plugs with grounding plugs so you can plug your laptop in or power tools or whatever you need. A couple USBs and there's upper lights and lower lights which I opted for because first of all you can see within the cabin and you can kind of root around for if you need anything. And also if you have all the doors open and the lights are on in the dark it kind of gives you like a surround lighting so if you need to do something at night it gives you the freedom to do so. And then last but not least, we have this cool little shower here. There's a 15 gallon water tank behind here and you can just refill it with a hose so it's super easy. And I got this because obviously rinse off in the cold weather or hot weather. It needs to drain a little so I'll leave it up here. And I got a cool first aid kit right here just to go with everything else in case I need anything. And then this whole operation here is actually powered by this really cool solar panel. And you can leave it out anywhere on the trailer. I like to put it up here behind the jack stands. And then you can actually plug it in with this right here. Using this plug. And that just charges in the sun. So if you're out having a field day and you're around the trail, you can just keep it plugged in and it just recharges everything pretty quickly. And so that's the right side of the trailer. All right, so we also have these magnetic clips here that can be stored inside the trailer and they clip on and off on the back real easy. And you can just hang the solar panel off. So just depending on where the sun is, it makes it super easy just to get like a full 360 for a solar option. So this is a little last minute addition that we put on. So we decided that when we tested everything out, I was a little bit too short to give it the ideal setup. So we decided to plug this little thing into the two inch receiver and stick a pin in it. So I can set it up with ease. On this side here, this is the driver's side. There's a lot of storage up here. You can see that it's divided by the 15 gallon water tank. So this I have yet to put stuff in. But for over here, I have all my survival equipment. So anything like coolers or um, any cooking supplies, which I have in here already. And then there's also this really cool hex wire that we used for um, making it a little bit lighter just because I don't have that heavy duty of a truck. So being able to pull it with ease is definitely something that I wanted. The thing that I'm most excited about is kind of seeing how it changes the way I camp. Before I had this uh, tent here on, it was mounted on the back of my bed and I would only be able to stay out 
probably a night, maybe two nights absolute max. With this, I can camp out for weeks at a time and be okay, especially because I'm fully reliant on the electricity from the solar panel. I have some water, so I can stay out pretty much as long as I want. Um, and then also I'm up higher, so if I'm camping and I hear something going by, I kind of feel safe in knowing that if it's an animal, it's not gonna come get me. And especially specifically to women camping, it just makes me feel like being higher up just it's definitely more secure and safe. And then as far as my plans for next year, I definitely would like to tour the East Coast, um, some beautiful places along from like Maine all the way down to the Carolinas. And then um, I am definitely thinking about taking another cross country trip towards the beginning of next summer and really nothing is off limits. So I guess we'll see where it goes.